Here we are live from the crime scene. Um, last night at 3.09 a.m., a major incident took place in this room where youths came through and soaked the members of this room. If you just come this way and if you look to the floor, you'll see some of the evidence that would give clues to why this really happened. You smell. Who could have left that? Just through the door is where the incident took place. Here you'll find the bed where the wet um, incident happened. Um, used through water off this um, ceiling, straight down onto Suzer's stew. Why this happened, no one knows. But we need to see what happened. And soon we will show you a reconstruction. Just up here you'll see some of the place where some of the water was stolen. And um, DNA has been taken um, of the water. Let's just see this reconstruction. This reconstruction was... Okay. As has been said, 3.09 this morning, youths came down the corridor, very suspiciously, very quietly, sussed out the situation in the room. And we just go in, we'll see the two people sleeping. And as they slept, snored, and whatever else. The ewes come out of nowhere and splash them. What the beep? What's up? <laughs> Clearly, you can see the two of you are very traumatised by last night's events. What exactly do you remember from the event, Suzer Stu? Well, it's, it's tra tragic and I'm, I'm, I'm still trying to get over the shock itself, but I was happily snoring sleeping in my bed and and all of a sudden I just got wet. Jonathan Corey, what can you remember from the last night's incidents? Well I was in a deep sleep, Keith, a really deep sleep, lying here in my bed and all I could hear was my partner wake up beside me and say what the and then I had to turn around and just try to say what's happened because I didn't know what had happened or I could feel it was a splash hitting me and I didn't know what it was. What saddens me from this whole event? I also believe we have legal parties involved and I'm sure we'll probably hopefully get an interview <coughs> with your lawyer. Yes, um, but what yes. saddens me in all this is the fact that we are the people, yourselves and, my, and me, are the ones who are trying to look out and protect the people in this castle. And it's sad that this happens to Big you. Time. But mm. what is your message to the people out there? who may feel a wee bit of danger and that they may be attacked too. Well, all we can say, and maybe you could vouch for me, that this will not stop us from doing <coughs> our duty. Yeah. Um, or the Oak Grill. Yeah, that, it, all it will do is just bring us closer together and we will find who's done this and they will regret it. <coughs> but, remember kids, two wrongs don't make a right. And also, we're just going to show you a clip of what we really are about and if you have a problem and you need help you call the A-Team. This is why the A-Team are so important. Yeah, try and give it the zooka clean. Hang right. up. Hang up. Yeah. That's a permanent. Yeah, that's a permanent. Get it somewhere. Get it somewhere. 